Greetings, YouTube. And I just realized that I had a numbering problem on some of these videos because this is supposed to be episode 178. And there were some screw ups. So those numbers were off. Yeah, it's not supposed to be that way because it's supposed to be 78, 79, and 80. I do them three at a time. But sometime in the 80, in the 60s, I missed numbered one. I think it was between, I think I skipped 64, 164, 163, 65. So those numbers are off. I have now corrected that. So anyone who's noticed this, you are correct. What I say, what's on the video, is not consistent. Um, I don't know if I'm going to go back and fix all that and put in notes for each and every video, or I'm just going to ignore it. <clears throat> because that's a lot of work of have me having to render every single one of those videos over even after it um, has been completed. So, any keen observers that noticed that um, what I was saying and what I was showing was not the same, yes, I'm aware of this. And I will have to probably make up a text so that I have something I can uh, um, post when see if someone says, hey, the numbers aren't consistent because they aren't consistent. Not that there are many people that are watching these videos. I freely admit this. Um... But, you know, I screwed up. I'll admit I screwed up. And uh, we'll move on. And she was silent in this room. Silent. Until I started talking. She's been sitting behind me on the floor quite pleasantly, doing nothing. I started talking, and suddenly, now she's here. I've created a monster. Um, okay, welcome to episode 178 uh, um, of the 4,000 Question Challenge. Let's get on with it. Um... Are you a conventional dresser? Always. Um, I I don't think I vary a great deal. I wear t-shirts and jeans at work. I wear t-shirts and uh, cargo pants or cargo shorts outside of work. Uh, in the cooler weather, I do wear a lot of sweaters. I don't know if that's a thing that lots of guys do, but I wear a lot of wool sweaters. In particular, my favorite is an alpaca, Peruvian alpaca with a hood. So that's probably not completely the standard for most men. But no, I do not diverge from um, male representation all that, that vastly. Oh, you are such a pain in my butt again. Yes, I know. It's like you've never been patting your... Don't sit on the keyboard. Do not sit on the keyboard. No. Go. Yeah. Go over there and break things. Um, uh, though I do use, use... I used to dress up when I was active in the SCA... Um, and I was wearing period or semi-period garb. So that was a bit out of the ordinary for your average American. Um, have you ever gone to a psychologist or therapist? Yes. I've seen a therapist for years. Uh, do you buy brand name clothes? I frequently buy brand name clothes, but I also buy them at thrift shops and yard sales and things. So I pay next to nothing for them and I don't buy them new brand name. I'm not I think I've purchased one brand name product new in the last decade. It was a pair of pants because I liked the brand and I wanted to get a different color. But no, I don't don't buy a lot of brand name clothes new. Um, do you take any type of vacation when you come down with a cold? Um, I tend to take just like NyQuil tabs or the generic version thereof because it helps me sleep. Um, but that's it. I'm not, I'm mostly, I'm taking them to help me sleep. I don't really think that they're going to do a whole lot beyond that. Um, mostly just because I want to be able to get some rest. Um, I don't think they're going to shorten my cold at all. Uh, what you have done at the beauty or barber shop and how often I have not been inside a beauty shop or a barber shop. Twenty, I may have been 23, 24 years old, so 30 years. Um, what daily health habit would you like to develop and be disciplined about? It'd be awesome if I were a, you know, a hardcore exerciser. That would be great, but it's not going to happen. How often do you go to the dentist, to the doctor? I see my dentist three times a year. Because as a diabetic, that means I have an increased chance of periodontal problems. And I see my doctor twice a year. Um, 
Have you ever worn uncomfortable shoes because they looked good? Have you ever worn uncomfortable shoes because they look good? Oh, the cat's doing things I don't want her to do. Um, she's crawling in behind the computer. I don't think I have. Honestly, I don't think I have. I think once I got to a point where I realized these shoes actually are uncomfortable, I stopped wearing them. Yeah. Um, do you give money to homeless people? No, I do not. I, I, I frankly admit I don't. Um, what do you wish for one wish for on pennies in a wishing well? I haven't wished on a wishing well in a very, very long time, so I couldn't tell you on that one. I can't remember the last time. Um, probably peace. And at the moment I make the wish, it would be either personal peace or universal peace. Um, but peace, that would, be a, that would be a good thing, I guess. So, thank you for being here for the properly numbered episode 178 of the 4,000 Question Challenge. So let's hope that we don't end up doing that again. That would be bad. Got to make sure that at the end of my, I always do threes, make sure that that number is actually divisible by three.